to our channel so today i'm going to be showing you guys all of the makeup that i'm going to be taking on our disney world vacation um i do like to have a full face of makeup nothing too heavy but something that's going to last me all day and then i'm going to look decent in pictures so yeah these are all the items that i'm going to take if you guys want me to do a makeup tutorial on how i put all of this makeup on my face then give this video a thumbs up and i will go ahead and do that for you guys so this is the bag that I take. Um, somebody actually gave this to me, so I don't know where they got it from. But I've had it for so long, and it's worked really, really well taking all my makeup on vacations. Um, it does. It will hang like from the door and stuff like that. So it has all of these compartments. I really, really like it. So let me show you guys what I'm going to put in there. Um, let's start off with how I actually apply it. So usually I do my eyebrows first. And I use the Anastasia Dip Pomade in Dark Brown. And then after that, I will do my foundation. So I'm taking two foundations. Um, the color that I am right now is W6, which is Sun Beige from L'Oreal True Match. When I get a tan, I am W7. So I like to mix these two together when I'm tan. Because this one's a little bit too tan for me. So this is the L'Oreal True Match. And then um, and that was in W6 and then this one's in W7. If you guys can tell, this one's a lot darker. So then after that, I will set my face. Um, I use the Ben 9 Banana Powder. This is actually my second one. I love this so much. Love it. So I would just set my face. With that, and then I'll do my contouring and my bronzing. So for contour, I use the CoverGirl. Um, this is actually a pressed powder, but I have it in Tawny, which is a really dark color. So it just looks like that. To contour my face, and then to bronze, I use the Milani Soleil Bronzer, which looks like that. Really, really pretty. It's very like glowy and stuff like that. After that, I would do my blush. Um, I have two blushes. I have, um, they're both from Wet n Wild. This one's Mellow Wine. And then this one is Heather Silk, which is really pretty. I would do my highlight. Um, I use the Becca Jaclyn Hill Champagne Pop Collection, which I'm also almost hitting pan on, but they're so pretty. So I use that and then, oh, I completely forgot concealer, but I use the Maybelline Age Rewind in Fair for concealing and highlighting. My battery's about to die. Jesus. Primer. Okay, I'm completely going out of order, but I use the um, Rimmel London Primer. Looks like that. All of this is pretty much a drugstore makeup. I mix it with some high-end um, eyeliners. I use the Wet n Wild um, for like to wing out my eyeliner. So I have the felt tip and then just the liquid liner. And then to tight line my upper eyelid and then lower, I use um, the Maybelline Master Drama and the L'Oreal Pencil Perfect. And they're both just black, like whole eyeliners. And then I, I need to take my mirror. This is just a Sephora mirror. Show you guys like that a curler to curl my eyelashes setting spray from nyx um this is the matte finish setting spray tweezers a sharpener and then the palette that i am gonna take is the Too faced peach palette which is very very neutral colors and it smells so good to set my eyebrows i use the elf clear mascara for my mascara i'm gonna use um i use a voluminous l'oreal waterproof i'm taking the waterproof just so that it's not running down my face elf blotting sheets to blot my face because i do get very oily in my t-zone and that's it so i'm gonna move on to the lippies 
Okay, so for the liquid lipsticks, I like to do the Kat Von D because they last all day and they don't smudge and they don't feel like drying on your lips. So I have the swatches on my hand, which I'm going to show you guys. Alright, so this one's Bachelorette, Mother, Double Dare. I don't know how to pronounce this one, but I will have it written down here. The next one is Suprema, and then this one is a Too Faced one called Very Berry. And I really, really, really do like them because they do last all day and they are very good like on your lips. So yeah, that's all the makeup that I'm taking for Disney. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.